Hey guys, it's Shamsa and welcome back to my little kitchen. Today's recipe is a game changer. Air fryer, chicken and rice, incredibly delicious, one tray meal, no hassle whatsoever and ready in 30 minutes. The best thing about this dish is that it just comes together really easily. You can add whatever you want into this and at the end of the day, you've got a wholesome homemade meal ready in no time. I'm going to try this and tell you guys exactly how it is. But before I do that, please make sure you hit that subscribe button, turn your bell notifications on and stick around and make sure you watch the video right till the end. And now the taste test. The chicken pieces are fully cooked. I'm just going to lift one up and show you. It's still hot. So fully, fully cooked chicken. And the seasoning that we added, which is the chicken stock, will flavour the entire dish. So here goes. Mmm, that is really good. Perfect amount of seasoning in there. Nice crunch coming through from the vegetables and the chicken. Soft and moist. Mmm, you know, if I was uh, served this, you would never know that this was an air fryer recipe. I would never know. Uh, I actually do resort to cooking <laughs> my uh, rice and stuff now in the air fryer. It's just so much easier than boiling it. All you do is just, you know, weigh out the ingredients, whack it into the air fryer for 30 minutes and, you know, job done. Why should we make our lives hard when we can do it easy? I hope you've enjoyed watching it. Now we're going to start cooking. So let's go. So the ingredients you're going to need is 200 grams of rice. I'm using VT extra long basmati rice because that's what I use at home. I've washed it several times and left it to soak for 30 minutes in fresh cold water. I've got here 250 grams of chicken breast fillet which I've cubed into medium sized pieces. Now I've got some frozen uh, vegetables here which I'm using which are perfect for this dish because it comes together really quickly. I've got 50 grams of frozen sweet corn and peas. Now you can use any frozen veg you wish that's entirely up to you. I've got here 15 grams in weight of pre-fried shop-bought um, onions. Now these are the ones without the uh, the coating. Some onions come with um, a flour coating on top. I tend to buy ones without the flour coating. So these are pre-fried and out. if you don't have these, you can leave them out. But if you wanted to add the onions in, you could do um, just fry them up at this stage and just weigh out 15 grams worth of onions. I've got here 200 milliliters of um, boiled kettle water. And we have the following two teaspoons of chicken stock. Now, if you don't have um, the loose powder chicken stock, then it is 10 grams in weight. So weigh your um, chicken stock cubes up to 10 grams. I've got here one teaspoon of cumin seeds and I've got here 20 grams of salted butter. Now, the foil trays that you need, the disposable trays are these. They're the medium foil trays that you can pick up from anywhere with the lids. Um, I got mine from Morrison's and you need one of those. So let's start cooking. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to go off and I'm going to drain my rice. So once you've drained your rice, you want to take the boiled water that you've got and into that I'm just going to add the chicken stock powder and I've got here the cumin seeds are going in as well and the butter. And we're just going to let that sit and we're just going to allow the butter to melt in there and we're going to move on to the next stage of the recipe. Right okay so before we start to assemble our chicken and rice tray we need to preheat our air fryer and for that select the preheat function and the temperature is 200 degrees C so just allow that to preheat while we assemble our chicken and rice tray. Right, so the air fryer has preheated and the first thing we're going to add into our tray is the chicken. So straight in with that. And just move it around and make sure that the base of the disposable tray is covered with the chicken pieces like that. And then the frozen peas go in just over. Then the sweet corn. And then the fried onions. Uh, 
and lastly the rice which goes on top and then we're going to take our stock that we made earlier and just just pour that over like that just move the cumin seeds around a little perfect and now take your lid and make sure you securely close this because this is what's going to help the rice and the chicken to cook in the air fryer if you don't have um, a, a lid for your tray you can use foil but i have tried the recipe with the foil and honestly the um the lids work much better because it's like sealed and all we're going to do now is we're going to transfer this to our preheated air fryer and cook this for 30 minutes at 200 degrees c so i'm just going to set my temperature 230 minute cook time don't touch it i'll see you guys back in 30 minutes time to show you the end result right okay so the 30 minute timer is up and i seriously can't wait to show you how the chicken and rice looks from the inside uh, just carefully remove this out it is hot but just if you're quick and careful you can just get it out like that or you can use a tea towel and i'm gonna position my camera and i'm gonna show you how this looks close up once i remove the lid so i'm just gonna go do that mm -hmm. 